Good afternoon guys, my name is Crystal and welcome to my YouTube channel. I've been out at Blue Water Shopping Centre for most of the day. I've also been into Rochester Cathedral where there is a dragon on display and a very nice elderly chap from Liverpool he explained all about the dragon in the cathedral. He was very polite and a very nice gentleman who actually spoke to me and told me some history. Very nice bloke from Liverpool in Rochester Cathedral today. Right, I want to show you what I got from Rochester Cathedral because I picked up a few bits and pieces. Um, so, we've got two postcards. One is the Jubilee Oak Table at Rochester Cathedral. And this one is the Jubilee Oak Table at Rochester Cathedral. 3,300 BC, the Jubilee Oak was likely to be 55 metres tall. 604 AD, Rochester Cathedral is founded. The current building stands at 63 metres tall. A couple of postcards. And we've got the Plants of the Bible playing cards. These are these cost about five pounds. Plants of the Bible playing cards. So they're a pack of playing cards. And they have got plants on them. So we've got the Pomegranate. The Punica Granatum. The temples, thy temples are like a piece of pomegranate within thy locks. Song of Solomon 4.3 So they are playing cards that have got plants that, have, that come out of the Bible. So we've got wheat, fig, bitter herbs, umbrella pine, walnut, cumin, cyclamen, and the star, I'll read the star of Bethlehem which is the Six of Hearts. Star of Bethlehem, Ornith the Galal, Galam, Ornith o Galal, Galam, Umbelatum, the fourth part of a cab of doves dung for five pieces of silver, the fourth part of a cob of doves dung for five pieces of silver two kings six two five that's the six of hearts i actually wanted to look at the queen of hearts the queen of hearts is bitter herbs like two car sativa and eat it with unleavened bread and bitter herbs numbers nine eleven so that's the Queen of Hearts. Plants of the Bible playing cards, very nice. Um, Patience is a solo card game. Patience. And I used to play it a lot when I was younger. It's a good, good card game. So, this delightful pack of playing cards portrays 54 different plants, trees and flowers which all grew in biblical lands and still grow there today. Some were staple food and some were used for their healing and aromatic properties. All are brought vividly to life in the delicate and beautiful artwork by artist Anne Gillies and show to perfection a wonderful collection of unusual playing cards which will give pleasure and joy to everyone with a love of nature. Common and Latin names are given together with a companion quotation from the Old Testament. We've also got this lovely rosary that cost me £6.50. Rosary. A nice little box. <coughs> Turquoise rosary beads with the cross. Jesus lying on the cross there. 
that is a turquoise rosary I had to get that we've also got <coughs> Ma Max, Max don't get anxious please please <coughs> stop it he's a good boy <coughs> no oh. it's the dog next door I do apologise Every time I try and do a video, the dog next door barks. I can't help it. I do apologise. St. George. St. George, patron saint of England. Keep us safe and protect us from evil. I do hope so. So you get a guide. Welcome to Rochester Cathedral. It's got the services on the back. And then you've got a, a layout of the cathedral there. This is Rochester Cathedral, Rochester, England, which is nowhere near Liverpool. It's in South East England in Kent. Right, so we've got that. That's what I wanted to show you that I got from Rochester Cathedral. I've also been to... Primark in Blue Water, and I'm going to show you what I got in Primark in Blue Water in another video. But I'm going to show you what I got from H&M Blue Water. This cost £8.99. This is Don't Try to Copy Me, You Won't Do It Right Anyway. A t shirt from H&M in Blue Water. Excuse that barking. Got a pair of socks as well for one pound fifty. Not bad. H and M Blue Water. What I'm going to show you is the stuff from Primark. When I when I finish this, no, no, it sounds like the dog chorus, doesn't it? It was quiet. It was quiet. Now the dogs have started coming out because they're a bunch of cowards. They don't do it when I've got visitors, do you? No, you wait till the visitors has gone and then you set the dogs off. Bunch of cowards, guys. Absolute cowards. I've had a visitor all day. I've had, Max, I've had a visitor and my visitors have gone and they kept quiet as fuck. They were so quiet. Now my visitor's gone Woof, 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 woof. Absolute cowards. Oh, and by the way, anyone that's following my YouTube channel and heard what I said to the police, you know that guy, Charlie, that came in, my, in the co-op said had gone to France, the one with the funny hat, the funny trousers, he's like a skeleton stooped over, the guy that touched me on the field. He's still hanging around Rochester, I was sat outside Costa Coffee and there he was, there was Charlie with his white dog. So that guy has not gone to France at all. I was told maybe he was thinking of going to France but he hasn't gone yet. So Charlie is still hovering about where I live with that white dog. After PC Underdown spoke to me about him when was it? Yesterday. Police officer Underdown. To ask me when I last saw Charlie. Well, I've just seen him this afternoon. While I was having a coffee with someone outside Costas. So, they all think they're going to start picking on me again when they've got another thing coming. See you later. Oh, Alexa, what's the time, please? The time is 5.44 p.m. Alexa, where am I, Crystal, located? From GameGuides.com. The crystal is located above the entrance on the left. No. Right, guys, I'm still in Rochester. 
I'm in Rochester. I've also got um, an Amazon delivery to show you as well that was left for Genestra, which is my my birth name. So I've got a parcel for Genestra. I came back. I took Max out for a walk as well this afternoon. So they wait for my visitor to go and then they start on me. See you later.